everybody, my name is Bella Diamond and welcome to Bella's Chair Dance Headquarters uh, where today it is the first day of Abs April and we're going to talk to you about your protein. Now we're going to have a chat with you about fats while we're there, so it's fats and protein um, and we just want to say thank you to Lumberjack Subs who are sponsoring us throughout Abs April because they are all bodybuilders um, and they know everything about diet and nutrition and they have helped to formulate a wonderful diet plan specifically for us ladies that is going to help us to get the most out of this final month. So remember why we're doing this guys, back in January we decided we'd have enough of being chunky little monkeys and that we were going to lose weight and we were going to get fit and we were going to do it together because when you do something together and you have a big support network, you have a lot more chance of achieving your goals. So we told Mind UK that we were going to raise them 10,000 English earth pounds. Now it is the last month of our mission, so we did Fit Feb, we've just finished Mission March, we are almost at seven and a half grand and we are now moving into abs apron. Now this video is specifically going to discuss with you your protein and your fats. So we want to make sure that everything that we tell you is really really simple. The diet plan has been designed to keep you energized to make sure that you are not going to get hungry and it's my job to make sure that you understand everything and to give you some awesome awesome swaps and options to keep us active but to keep us enjoying what we're eating as well. Okay so we spoke about in one of our early videos for our diet plan that although we are not counting calories, we are not weighing our food, and we're not going to quit drinking either, yeah? Vodka, gin, magic mixers, they're okay. We do need to be really, really strict on our portion control. So Abs April is all about stripping away the fat that's left on top of our tummies, yeah? So diet and exercise are coming hand in hand. This is the diet. So what we'd advise you to do is to go out and get some of these measuring cups. You can buy these from Asda, they're only three pounds. There are only three food groups that we're that bothered about. So I want you to remember at home that salad, fruit and vegetables, fruit, it's all, that's free. Eat as much as you like, crack on. The three food groups that we're gonna concentrate on are your protein, your carbohydrate, and your fat. But this video is all about your protein. Now what you can see here is that the protein should always be the biggest portion. And what they say is it should be a fist for your carbs, your hand for your protein, and your thumb for your fats. Now, let's make it nice and simple. Having these is gonna make things much, much easier. So per serving per meal, remember, we're going to four small meals a day now. One serving, the biggest one, should always be protein. Now, we are going to have to go on a red meat ban just for one month. Don't waste it, stick it in the freezer, guys. We'll eat it in May. But for this one month, we're gonna to have to go onto a red meat ban because red meat contains a lot of fat, which is why in this video, we're gonna to talk to you about your protein and your fats. You can see, guys, you're allowed one cup of protein per meal, four meals a day. You're only allowed half a tablespoon of fat. <laughs> so, protein. Let's have a think. What we did in Fit Feb and Mission March was we followed a low carb, high protein diet where we all did smash in our bacon and our sausages and we got used to having all of that lovely, yummy animal fat. <laughs> yeah, not for abs April, guys, I'm sorry. Everything is turning around. So what we're gonna have to now do is we're gonna have to swap the food items that we're used to with something that's going to be a lot less fat. So I've been out and I've bought loads of different products that I want to show you. First thing that I found are turkey rashers. Bernard Matthews, lightly smoked turkey rashers. Now, to be honest, they look like bacon. I like turkey. Low fat. 32 calories a slice. Well, that's not a lot. And to be honest, we're not even counting calories, so that's fine. So if you are and you have been really enjoying smashing in your bacon, sorry Halo, um, and now you're really quite worried about not being able to eat bacon and it's one of your favorite things. What you should go and do, and to be honest guys, this didn't actually cost any more than a normal rashers of bacon did. It's not expensive. Go and get it swapped now for your turkey rashers. So you're gonna put your bacon in the freezer, freeze it down, and for Abs April, we're gonna move over to turkey rashers instead. Trust me, they're delicious. Sausages. 
yeah, me and Haley every day, we were posting pictures of our sausages. And we did talk about a sausage only has to be 20% meat to be classed as a sausage, didn't we? And we all moved up to 80% pork sausages. Now, for Ab's April, the pork's got to go. Sorry, guys, still a red meat, not allowed that. So instead, we're going to switch them with chicken sausages. Now, Heck is a really, really good brand. These are tried and tested. These do taste really lovely. They've got the texture of sausage. Um, I mean, obviously it's chicken, but it's the closest to a healthy low fat sausage that you're gonna get, right? So you wanna give these a try. And again, they don't cost any more than normal sausages, guys. Um, there's no nasties in them whatsoever. And they're gluten-free, which is wonderful. 85% chicken um, and just some absolutely fantastic stuff that's not even worth looking at. Yeah, these are great. Now, mince. We all like lasagna. We all like our chilies. We all like our hamburgers. We can still have them, guys. But we're going to have to switch from beef and lamb over to turkey. Turkey is the leanest meat on the, well, available to anybody. Turkey. It's where it's at. Turkey mince is also a lot cheaper. Get in. Um, so, turkey meat is practically less than 3% of fat, that is amazing. Now with your turkey mince, you can still go ahead and you can make your lasagna, you can make your chili, you can make your homemade burgers for the barbecue, yeah? Turkey is fantastic and it is also much, much cheaper as well as being very, very, very low fat. So by switching from everything that we like, and there's one more here, turkey steaks, instead of your steak. Now I know that's not gonna go down well. If you like a really nice, big, fat, juicy T-bone, swapping it for a turkey steak um, isn't gonna be ideal. But it's only for one month, guys, yeah. Now, we're swapping all of this out and it is gonna be absolutely amazing. But what we're actually then doing is we are lowering our fat intake to fit into here, okay? So all of these lovely, delicious meats, Switching to the turkey, switching to the chicken, um, we are going to still have a nice high protein intake, but we're going to lower our fats. Now, protein is in a lot of other things as well, so let's have a chat. Fish, tuna, mm, mackerel. Now again, mackerel and the likes of salmon, and I love salmon, and I've got some fresh mackerel here as well because I just can't get enough of it. These things here are quite high fat, but it's good fat okay so the fats that you get in fish very good for you and that is what we want in our one fat serving with every meal fish is incredible so different types of fish and some people don't bother eating fish and it's not because they don't like it they're just not quite sure how to cook it so we have on our Bella's Chair Dance South Yorkshire Facebook page a group that's public everybody can get in there and it's Abs April recipe ideas and all of my girls are absolutely wonderful they've all been cooking and sharing recipes so we thought why don't we just make it into a public group on Facebook where everybody can dip in and out and have a look and just pick from what they want to so if you're worried about how do I cook these things, I've never had them before, take a look at that group, guys. Now, you've also got prawns. Prawns are very, very good for you. They are lush. And um, we've got some cod. Mm, smoked salmon, that's like chocolate to me. That's one of my favorites. And then we have yummy, yummy, pure protein. Get inside you eggs, okay? So when we're saying four small meals a day, but your biggest portion on that plate should be your protein. We're talking eggs, we're talking all fish, we're talking chicky and turkey. Dead easy, okay. Now you are gonna to wanna to flavor that up a little bit um, because it can be a little bit bland on its own, but you remember you're replacing the dark meat with the white meat, but cooking it in exactly the same manner. You're gonna be fine. I've bought a load of different flavorings that I'm gonna share with you on a different video as well. And we're gonna be posting those ideas in there. Now, if you're thinking exactly the same as me, where's the cheese? Isn't cheese protein? You told us in Mission March, Donna, that cheese was protein. Cheese is protein, my darlings, yes. However, it's also very, very, very high fat. So for Mission March, that is gonna be one of the things that we do need to cook out, okay? Sorry. Um, so dairy products, wonderful. Low fat yogurts, but please check the sugar content on them as well. You don't want them to be too high in sugar. And um, we're not cutting out milk, but probably switch to semi skimmed if you can. And cheese is, ooh. Now the thing with cheese is, soft cheese, very high fat. Hard cheese, much less. 
So if you go for a cheese like Parmesan, that's the hardest cheese, that is the lowest fat cheese available, okay? And you can grate a little bit on top of everything that you eat just to get that little bit of a fix, okay? But on the whole, we're gonna have to say no to cheese, okay? So it is a yes to white meat, it's a yes to eggs, it's a yes to fish, but it's gonna be a no to cheese, sorry guys. Um, and it is gonna have to be a no to red meat just for one month. Now the meal plan is, four small meals a day, sticking to our portion control. Now, I don't know about you guys at home, but I am really, really busy. And trying to factor in four small meals a day can sometimes be quite difficult when I get really engrossed in what I'm doing. So Lumberjack Sups have sent me my very own protein. Now, I am celiac, so I can't have gluten, which is barley, wheat, rye, and bulgur wheat, and most of us are also lactose intolerant, so I couldn't have protein anyway, and um, because it's made from whey. <laughs> now this beauty here, this bad boy, from the Lumberjack Subs website, lumberjacksubs.com, this is no whey. It's gluten-free, it's not made with whey, and it is high protein. This is a protein shake for me. So what I'm doing is I'm switching out. I'm having my breakfast, but my second meal is a protein shake. So if you have got a really busy lifestyle, um, and I know if you're still at full-time work, it'd be kind of tricky, can't it? So why don't you take a protein shake to work with you? Then you've already got one of your meals in the bag. You still have your lunch break at work as normal, and then you're just slotting in the other two when you get home, aren't you? Dead easy. So, protein is essential. Let's recap. One cup of protein, but that protein needs to be very, very, very low fat, guys. All right. So, please check out our recipe group on Facebook. If you've got any questions, please do come and ask me. Um, and I want to show you a little product before we all go um, by the Gym Kitchen. So, I pick these up in Asda. I get these quite regularly, actually, and they're awesome to take to work. So, it is absolutely fantastic to eat something that has already been portioned for you. The gym kitchen are doing these ready meals. I am, I am that lazy. And um, they do Thai green chicken and chicken tikka. I mean, there's loads of different flavors available. Now, each one of them is, chicken tikka has got 34 grams of protein in it, yeah? Amazing. Thai green chicken, 31 grams of protein. Absolutely fantastic. So what the gym kitchen has actually done for you is sticking to that diet plan, that fitness bodybuilder diet plan. They've actually put your meals together for you. Oh, look at that. These in Asda at the minute is two for a fiver. It's two pound 50, it's cheaper than school dinners, right? So if you normally take lunch into work with you, I would advise you to go and try some of these from Asda during Ants April. You don't even have to think about it. Grab one out of the fridge, stick it in your own bag, get some off to work. Thank you for listening. Remember, no red meat and no cheese. No cheese. Sorry, Hayley. Good luck, guys.